Well, good morning, boys and girls, men, women, and uh, children, maybe. I don't know. Maybe you think that I'm entertained. I doubt it. Uh, but as well, Carlos here with a two-fold video. And it's uh, 8.06 in the morning, and there's nothing wrong with waking up to some AC, DC at 8.06 in the morning. Heck, I was listening to it a lot earlier than that. Uh, okay, back in black. There's significance to that, to this video. And that's because I have a new canted Levat Rick Black. That's where it's coming from. The the, court, the uh, correlation. And if you can see that, very nice. It has a caramel colored stem matching the silver band. Very nice. Very nice bike. And this is not my first Rick Black pipe. Um, very reasonably priced. They smoke well. And smoking well. Talking about that. I'm smoking for the first time on the maiden voyage. Something Rick had gifted me. Just a, you know, a little a pouch, a quarter, you know, or a bowl and a half, or something like that, which I greatly appreciate. You, you know, I've never smoked Mississippi River and living in Mississippi. I wanted to, and I've heard all these good things about it. And of course, you never know. You've got people out there that like to jump on a bandwagon and and, and like something that. Everyone else, they can't, they don't want to admit that they're, they're maybe they're different, or, but they don't care for something. I mean, it's, and that, you know, that's what makes our, our pipe community so special is that you can voice your opinion and not be afraid to, um, to speak your, speak your opinion or like something or not like something. But I'll be damned. It is good. Virginia Latakia and Perique. Uh, Perique is made, I shouldn't say just down the road, but a couple hours down the road. Which isn't far. I'm, I mean, I've been there many times. Not, not to the St. James Parish. I think I've been pretty close many times. I just never had an opportunity to go down there. And, and when you're down there, if you ever get down there, you need to go to the Tabasco uh factory as well because I mean, Tabasco is made down there and, and, and you'll find that the Tabasco and the Perique are very similar in nature as to with the way they were made. But getting off track a little bit there, the Mississippi River is everything that uh, I've heard. I mean, smokes well in an unadulterated pipe at all. I mean, nothing's been in this pipe but Mississippi River. I filled it up. With that, I do have a little bit of new briar flavor, and I, but I can differentiate that, and as it gets farther down, it kind of goes away, so... Oh, that's not what I wanted. I just hit the wrong song, boys and girls. So, I'm just going to change it quickly. Hopefully before it comes on. This is called Thunderstruck. And I don't know if you're familiar with ACDC Thunderstruck, but I was thunderstruck by this tobacco. In the way it smoked. It's extremely smooth. Uh, it has a good flavor. Not overpowering by any means. It's not, it's not what I expected, I guess, um, from what people were talking about and, and how they were talking about it. 
the um I expected something heavier but that's what makes the pipe whirl go around is the difference in flavors as well or, or your taste buds I should say pardon me um, I had a good weekend I suppose had went to the Harley shop waiting for some things to come in um, see what I what I, the next bike I'm gonna get is I haven't determined that yet I've got a few things on my on the board uh, the dealership he's talking to me about some things and I, and I don't know what I what I'll decide on but I, I don't even know if you know, but I was in a motorcycle accident about 13, about 12 months ago. Uh, and, um, well, close to 12, March 15th of 12, or 13, pardon me. And been laid up since, had five surgeries. Uh, but YouTube community and Facebook community has really helped me out. Uh, just to, to get out feelings and talking, having an outlet. Um, I never was that involved with it either until the accident. Um, I hope to go back to work part time if I can if I can deal with the pain is basically what I've been told. I, and I think I can. I, 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 don't, I don't know. I mean, there's days where it's worse than others. Um, but in order to get a new bike, I've got to get a new job. Now, the part time it, it is, is about all I can expect for myself at this point. And I and I expect that, but my body doesn't expect that. I guess that's the thing. You know, I, I don't know if any of you, I'm sure some of you have been in this place before in your life. And if you have, you know what I'm talking about. If you haven't, I hope you never have to go through it. The um, match almost burned out there. I had to catch it. Catch and save. Catch and save. So, it's just been a long road. It's stealing a title from Tom Petty. It's been a long, long road. Uh, to recovery but if I can just take a little part-time job someplace that I, and I have an idea where that might be uh, and then my whole family being my, my my son my daughter and I will all be working at the same place and so the Carlo family will, will be uh, all employed by the same employer not same location full location so can't do that then it's not allowed but I worked for this organization or company for 10 years so that, I, that I'd be going to so I'm familiar with their procedures and policies and my my youngest is learning about policies and procedures the hard way hurt his finger and then didn't report it and I told him I said you got you, you have to report that kind of stuff um, immediately you know and there's a reason for that and and I know that from the job that I was in you know during that 10 year tenor and yeah you, know, you, you just you got to notify management immediately upon um, uh, let's see that's where I finished that statement let's see what do y'all want to listen to has played too much. Um, that's not too long. That's not long enough. Well, it might be. Um, okay. We'll just go with a classic. Hell's Bells. Bell tolls for Bon Scott. So he's learning the hard way, my son is. 
And, um, anyway, um, I guess this video is just about over for Venezuela, but, um, the weekend, like I said, nothing really special. The song's louder than the other one was. By the download. Not by me. Um, but I didn't do a lot this weekend. Uh, didn't feel well yesterday at all. I uh, thought I was coming down with something, but maybe it was just a 24 hour bug and I beat it because I, I, I went to the Harley shop, had breakfast with friends of mine, which I tend to do every Saturday morning. And then, um, either on my bike or obviously since I don't have a bike right now and I couldn't ride one until just recently and um, I had, we had breakfast every Saturday and I took some time off and I found that uh, it's not a good thing because I separated myself but um, anyways I'm getting better and I, I appreciate everybody here in, on the YouTube community and the Facebook community, thank you. You've really helped me more than you know, just by letting me talk. And, and you don't know, you didn't even know what I was, why I was talking and why I came about. But um, that's the reason. That's that's one of the reasons. So thank you. Um, I hope you subscribe. Venezuela, the Carlos, the sensitive guy, the sensitive side. Music may not be. But, that's it, so, remember, rock and roll ain't noise and pollution, so, listen to the music, have a good day.